Can you come, sir? I want to congratulate you. Eh? Amen. You understand? Amen. Don't look at these people who are leaving you. Amen. Eh? Amen. You hear me? Yes. Because people are leaving you now. Yes. And you are saying, why are they leaving me? Yes. Eh? Yes. Stand up. Me, I'm praying for what I'm saying now, that the same people who are leaving you are not part of you. Amen. Allow them to go. Go give you the right people in Jesus' name. Come, bring him to me. Let me do oh. like this. Yes, you are blessed. The wrong people must leave you. The right people must come. The wrong people must leave you. The right people must come. Amen. When you see people leaving them, you must be excited. Amen. Even myself, I'm very happy about people who leave my ministry. Because I don't want anybody. I want God. I don't want everybody. I want what? What God has brought. So it's God who bring people in the church. Let them live. The right people will come. Amen. You hear my brother? Where is my brother? You hear what I'm saying? Yes, I'm eh? hearing you. I'm eh, hearing you. Because them. they are lying. Yes. You know they are talking against you. I know very much. Eh? Yes, I know. Eh, they are building up stories. Yes. That you don't even know. Yourself, you are even surprised. Ah, I don't even know these things. Amen. Eh, eh. Amen. You, you have never used a charm. Yes. But why do you say you are using a charm? Yeah. Huh? They are saying uh, I'm using a charm and I, I don't know so why. So you know I was not there. Yes. So why do they say they use a charm? So now these are the people that God will expose them. Allow them to go. Amen. And God will give you the best people ever. <laughs> when, when people leave the church, they create stories. Look here. How many years I'm in the ministry? Charis here was started in 1999. Here, this church in Tembisa, 1999. But people are still lying about me. And when I started the ministry, they were still schooling, wearing uniform, going to school, uh, doing uh, history and geography. <laughs> but now they are here in Joburg. They say, I'm using this. I'm using that. People love to talk. They love to talk. Many people came to Charis, they had nothing. They had nothing. The moment when they use a cream and, and they begin to be white people, they say, this man is not good. But they've learned to use cream in Charis. <laughs> in Charis, we teach people to use cream. I'm telling you, people, people learn things in charities. From there, they go out. We, we show them in charities that I have mama here. Many people in charities, they are copying things from mama. When mama starts to wear like this, they want to wear like that. If mama put Brazilian, they want Brazilian. Spanish is Spanish. Indian is India, isn't it? Eh? I'm telling you the truth. So now, how, think about, me I was supposed to have been fallen if we were supposed to fall. From 1999 until now, you still think you can put me down. Even now, when I'm old like this, I will laugh at you. But I I'm telling you. Do you know Zulu? Because 10 years, if a ministry is supposed to fall, it's supposed to fall. 20 years, the ministry is supposed to fall. 20 years. 25 years, the ministry is supposed to fall. And where were you? How do you want to put down a ministry of 20 something years. God will, will deal with it. But I've got only one prayer to the people who are gay pastors. God must not punish them. God must open their eyes to understand that he's God. But on my side, I'm praying for only one prayer, that God must stretch your nose 
you must, you must pull your nose like this. It comes here. You see your nose here, like this. It's then you will come back here for prayer. Do you know one old lady visited me there for one on one? She came to me. I was supposed. I was supposed. To, she was supposed to have seen Prophet Andres. Andres denied on Saturday. She's supposed to see me on Sunday. When she came, I sent her to Prophet Andres. When she reached there, Prophet said, "No, you can't see me. Go and see." Uh, my father that side. She reached on the other side. I said, oh, I'm sure, I'm sure you remember the lady. Come. This man was there. We were making her like a ball. We didn't know. You remember? I remember very well. What happened? Uh, you were taking him, you were taking her to, to the other side and then she came this side and again to the other side. So we're just like this. So, when prophet sent her back to me, I, me, I said, Mama, I don't know what to tell you. Go say I must not speak with you. Why go say I must not speak with you? Tell me. She kneeled down. She kneeled down. She says, I was insulting you. I was attending another church that hate you. So I want to confess. I took her out. She confessed. Well, confession is important because you are supposed the same way you, you spoke out against me you go to prophet prophet says no you are supposed to see me me I say no you can't see me I'm here I must not speak with you go and see the prophet first if prophet speaks with you I'll speak with you prophet reached there I said no I can't speak with you he came back to me I said no you, I know mama sorry you pay one on one, yes. He says, I paid money. I says, Mama, it means we have to give you your money. Because God said, I must not speak with you. Do we, were you there? Yes, did. You were there? Yes. What is it that she said? Uh, she said she's uh, one of those people who were insulting you. Yes. Because someone spoke when was advertising me and say, I'm like this. And other people also join of the church and spoke against. Now, these are the people who are coming to see us one on one. And now she came. Me, I want to help her. Go say, no, don't speak with her. You see, you are insulting servants of God, you are insulting servants of God, it will come back to you.